Good morning. It has been a long time since I've made a movie. Well, I'm back at it. And I'm really excited about it. I'm going to try something here. You guys see what this looks like right now? The film quality? Well, I'm going to switch to another camera right now and see if it makes a difference. See if you can tell a difference. Hold on. One second. How's that? I think it's a little better. It should be like 50,000 times better. Um, I got a new camera and I'm super, super excited about it. I'm scared to death I'm going to break it. <laughs> Sorry, I've got food all over my mouth. I, I noticed looking back at my old videos, I always have food on my mouth. So I'm going to be more conscious of that in my new videos. And speaking of that, there's going to be a lot more videos coming. Sorry, I have hair all over me, dog hair, because I'm babysitting my friend's St. Bernard, and she sheds like crazy. I have hair through my entire house. So, it's kind of crazy right now, but, uh, yeah, I'm covered in hair. It's in my mouth, everywhere. But, this camera is the Canon G7X, and it's a camera used by a lot of vloggers, a lot of YouTubers, and I cannot seem to get the right angle to hold it, but... I'm gonna practice with it and learn, but it's an awesome camera. The image is so much better. And right now, it's like you can tell the difference, I'm sure, from when I just first started a minute ago, how darker, much darker it was to now. The light sensitivity sensor is awesome with this camera. The low light situations you can film in is amazing. So. I think the quality is going to be a lot better. But anyway, I'm over here in the woods. We're running with the dogs. And it is freezing out here. Tyson, come here. Good boy. But yeah, it's freezing over here but we still make our daily journey to the woods to get some exercise. It's muddy as hell, so they're getting a bath anyway tonight, so I don't care if they get muddy. Go on, bus. Go play. Go play, come on, let's go, come on. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> anyway, I'm glad you guys stuck around and I hope you will stick around for my new videos. I have a lot of new stuff coming up. I have some collaborations that I'm working on with other YouTubers and some skits. Just little funny skits, or at least ones that I think are funny. <laughs> but, um, and then vlogs, getting back to the vlogging again. Had some time off, did a lot of learning, and had some rough times, but made it through those, and I'm back doing what I love, which is filming, and I hope you guys will stick with me through this and enjoy my videos. Look at this view where we're at. We're over here in the woods, and this part of the woods always freezes. And you can actually ice skate back here when this freezes. Um, but probably here in a few weeks this will be pretty frozen. It, it's halfway frozen now, but... Anyway, yeah, this is my new G7X. It's an awesome camera. It films at 1080 and 60 frames per second, which is about 5 million trillion times better than my old camera. I stopped filming originally because I was losing. It's hard for me to figure out where to look. I'm looking up here at the screen instead of down here at you. Um, I was filming with my old camera and I was losing half of my footage. It would, I would load it onto my computer, all the footage that I took for the day, and it would say, <clears throat> images are corrupt and they were just gone. So it was really super duper frustrating and I gave up on it and uh, quit for a while. Of course, there were some other circumstances why I quit filming too, but uh, 
I'm not gonna talk about that right now, maybe in the future. Um, but uh, basically a relationship. <laughs> but oh, that's all I'm gonna say about that. Um, but yes, my new videos I'm excited about. A lot of new stuff planned. I've got a lot better equipment now. Um, I hope you enjoy this unboxing video. It's not comprehensive. It doesn't, I don't tell everything about this camera because I do not know everything about this camera. I don't even know very much at all except how to push the record button. <laughs> so it's just a generic unboxing video. And I think it's awesome because this camera retails at like $6.99, I think. And I got it. it it's brand new for... 509 bucks off of eBay a really good seller and it wasn't just the camera I, I it was a whole kit of stuff memory card um, tripods carrying case all kinds of stuff that I got for five hundred nine dollars for this camera sorry I just ate and I think it's stuck in my chest <laughs> but um, really good deal and I'm ex super excited about it and really excited to film a lot with this camera and so much stuff coming up next week I have an awesome video coming up from a new new uh, uh, sponsor something that I'm getting that I will be utilizing in probably almost every vlog that I do I pretty much imagine that I will um, it's an awesome device. I'm not going to say what it is right now, but uh, next week. I should get it on Wednesday and then Thursday. Uh, I should have a video out about it. And then from there, you'll probably see it every day because it's awesome. Another announcement, and this is awesome too. I am now partnered with Broadband TV. They represent my videos, promote them, and um, it's just awesome. They saw my videos and liked them, and so it's, I, I don't know, it's kind of like an agent, I don't know, something like that, but uh, it is an agent. Yeah, so that's really cool. I was really, really just so happy to um, get called from them and uh, knowing that somebody likes my videos <laughs> so I've been working to really improve the content and what I do and the quality and everything so hopefully we're gonna see that this year and 2016 I'm hoping is our year on this channel to really make it big and do well because I love doing this I really really love doing this better than anything else I was a teacher for 11 years and I love doing that but I love this a lot more so let's get on to the unboxing video and this is my first vlog for 2016 hope you enjoy it and I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you here in just a minute I got the Canon PowerShot G7X this is a camera used by a lot of vloggers on YouTube it's an awesome camera this camera retails at $6.99, but with a little bit of research, you can get it for a lot cheaper. I found it on eBay from a trusted, well-known, reputable seller for $509. And it didn't just come with the camera. I'll show you everything that it came with here in a minute. It's a small, compact camera. Fits in your hand nicely. For vlogging. The thing that I love the most about this camera is this. The flip up screen. So that when I'm vlogging I can see myself. Small, high quality, great images, and great video. And there's so many things that this camera does. But let me show you some of the other things that came with the camera. This is the charger and this plugs right into the back of it. and plugs right into your wall. And your battery installs super easy. Put it in there, snap it in, plug it in your wall. And this light 
right here, it says charge, will be orange. And when it's orange, it's charging. Down here, when it's full, that'll turn green. So, uh, the first battery I charged took right around two hours. And that's it. I've got a full battery. Nice little strap for the camera, which I doubt that I'm going to put on it. Also came with a tripod. It's not a bad t tripod. Um, it's, uh, I believe, 53 inches high, but easily extended. Can't, I can't zoom out on this, but you can see tripod and locks really tightly so that's a nice bonus that I got with the camera it sets up easily it's very sturdy sturdy actually uh, this thing here in the back works to tilt it up and down so then you tighten it to affix it in one place and there's other screws to turn it so it has a few functions on that tripod which is pretty nice I'll definitely be using that tripod also and it came uh, the tripod came with a little case this also came for that $509 with a 32 gigabyte SD card which is nice and it came with an external flash so that is really cool mounting hardware and then I haven't even taken anything out of the packaging but then the flash definitely be using that uh, gold uh, USB cords I don't know they're supposed to be higher speed or something because they're gold I'm not sure I don't know a cleaning kit and inside the cleaning, this is for the lens cleaning kit, um, little Q-tips and a cleaner solution and wipes. And then also a little tabletop tripod that my camera will mount on. I don't know if you can see it, hopefully. But yeah, a little tripod. That'll come in handy also. Got that. Um, and this little high-speed, high-capacity digital micro secure reader writer so you plug this right in to your camera and you can extract all of your of your film and pictures right off of it if your memory cards getting too full and then you can continue shooting so that's pretty cool that came with it too and then a nice carrying case I also bought two extra batteries. These were separate, but it's important, I think, with this camera especially, to have some extra batteries because the filming time that I read about says only 40 minutes of film time. So you want to have an extra battery or two, so I went ahead and got two. Okay, I'm going to show you a few things about this camera. All right, so I will show you how to install the battery, which I know how to do on the bottom there's a little switch pull it back and the lid flips open there is a little button right here that has to be pushed back for the battery to be put in so I just put it in at an angle slide it down in and it snaps in and that little piece covers the top and holds it in okay also your little uh, SD card goes right in here too it slides right in presses down and, and it kind of clicks into place and then you can close your lid and you can see this is where your tripod mount is on the bottom one cool thing about this camera it has a one inch sensor which is huge for a compact camera so your image quality is just amazing for a camera of this size on and off switch right here on top turns on right away you can see that there's no lens cap either you can see the little uh, pedal uh, cover and whatever they call that pedal cover let me do it again 
that's it. And I've got my flip up screen. And it shows what I'm filming. And I don't know what I'm filming because it's faced the other way. <laughs> okay, I'll show you all your settings are right up here on this dial auto. Turns very crisply. Movie mode. Custom. I don't know. Manual. Who knows? I don't know what all these mean. I have to keep reading the book. Okay, got that. Um, your on and off switch right here on top. Your focus. Focus in on the stuff on the table. Pretty cool. And like I said, this flips all the way up so that when you're filming. Whoa. Where am I? I'm behind the camera, but you can see yourself when you're filming then. Okay. Otherwise, your menu and other functions are back here, which I have no idea what a lot of these do. Like I said, I know how to push the record button so far. And I know how to take pictures, <laughs> but I'm going to learn here and uh, hopefully be putting out some good videos for you guys. There's a nice little grip here, which helps um, when you're vlogging. There's no grip on the front or anything, so kind of have to have a good grip, I guess. But uh, it's such a small camera. I think it weighs 10.7 ounces, so it's not heavy. It's light, easy to put in your pocket easy to carry around, and easy to hold. So, oops, I'm pushing buttons on the back. That reminds me, this is a touch screen, so you can focus with your finger and all that, which I have not learned to do yet, which I will soon. But, uh, yeah, that's it for this camera. Oh, no, it's not. The flash is right here. There's a button on the side. When you push that button, the flash pops up. It's a non-movable flash. It just points straight, which is fine for me. It doesn't bother me. Oh. Yeah, pops right back into place. And that's it. So, I'm going to film a bunch of things here today. I'm going to do a time lapse and some other things. Maybe talk, take the dogs to the woods. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But I want to mess around with it. And actually, I am recording with it right now. Uh, and uh, take it around and do some shots but yeah anyway I will talk more about this camera as I get to know it and know how to use it and know what the functions are but uh, I'm super excited about the quality my quality of videos the images everything is just gonna be much 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 better with this camera so alright on with the rest of our day I hope you guys enjoyed that video uh, the unboxing and seeing what this camera is and hopefully I'll, I'll get into more about what this camera can do as I learn each day what it does. I've been reading the book a little bit but it's so hard to understand the terminology used in, in those kind of manuals. Uh, it's just, it's hard and uh, so I'm getting it but it's going to be slow. So anyway, 2016 this is going to be a big year for us. I have so much planned. And my goal right now is to get to 10,000 subscribers. We've got almost 5,200, I think, right now. And it's going up between 10, 15, 20 new subscribers a day. So for me, that's great. But I want to just keep growing it and getting more and more. And let's get to 10,000 subscribers. And the way we're going to do that is if you share my videos with people. Share them on Facebook or on YouTube or just tell people, look for the Benji the Bobcat channel and, and subscribe. When people subscribe, that really helps me out and helps me to be able to continue filming, which I love doing. And the content, the content and what I do in my videos is all going to be affected by that and improve. The more subscribers we have, the better the videos, the more I can do. So, have a great day, and I will see you soon.